Hey guys, I'm gonna quickly summarize Apple's keynote. So it's all about your Apple TV Plus, News Plus, Arcade, and Cart. Yes, there's those four things that they covered over the keynote, and let's get down to it. So the very first one's Apple TV Plus. They're just adding a bunch of stuff into Apple TV. So you will be able to access more shows and just more stuff within Apple TV. However, now it's gonna be all about the Apple TV app, which will be available on Samsung TVs and all other TVs later on. So as long as it's smart TV, this app will be available there and all the services from it. Like I mentioned, the services, it's just providing more shows, movies, and so on within the app. The entire keynote event really is all about services that Apple is gonna provide you guys with. Next up, we have Apple News Plus. Apple News Plus, it's all about a subscription-based app. And this is something that you guys can try right now with Apple News Plus. All you guys have to do is pay $9.99 a month and you guys get access to 300 magazines. The good thing about this is that you can share this subscription with six members of your family. And that's it for Apple News Plus. Next up, we have Apple Arcade. Apple Arcade, it's all about your subscription. As long as you guys pay the subscription into this, you guys get access to a ton of games. And you don't just get access to them online as long as you have internet, but you guys can actually download the games and play them offline. Now this is not up and running just yet, but it's getting there and we will be able to play this and subscribe to this later on. And finally, we have the Apple Card. Apple Card is just a credit card that Apple made. And no, they're not a bank. They're associated with a bank and with MasterCard. So if you look at their website, it's an actual physical credit card. They're partnered with MasterCard. The good thing about this credit card is that you guys can actually see where you spent your money. That's what I really like about this particular credit card, that it syncs up directly and can tell you if you guys spend a certain amount of money on entertainment, food, drink, shopping, and so on. And finally, they actually waive a lot of fees that traditional credit cards would actually charge you. So there's a ton of fees that you guys will not see, such as an annual fee, cash advance fee, that I'm pretty surprised with, over the limit or late fees. Those do not exist with this credit card, which is pretty cool from Apple. Anyways, guys, so that's it for this keynote. Really, the keynote could have been a lot shorter because all you're covering is Apple TV+, Plus, News+, Plus, Arcade, and Card, which they're not humongous, I think the credit card was the most important one. The arcade is okay. I never really like playing games on my Apple TV. Of course, arcade's not just for your Apple TV. You guys can play it on your iPhone, iPad, or Touch. News Plus is pretty cool. It's something that Apple was missing anyways. Those magazines with the subscription so you can access a ton of magazines. And Apple TV Plus, which is good because now you're gonna be able to access this streaming service on your smart TV and you won't have to buy an Apple TV in order to access this. Anyways, that's it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.